Hi friends, welcome back. So this is the example which we discussed in previous session. So in this example, we have explained how to create the bootstrap alerts. So whenever user is trying to create employee or editing or deleting the user, whenever we click the button, so this bootstrap alert will be displayed to the user and it will close automatically after given time duration. If you see the alert messages in each view we have added error message as well as the success message if you see the other views like delete here also we use the error message if you go to the index so we have validated the error message as well as success message instead of keeping in individual views we can make it as a generic one where for entire project we can place it in one place their application we can create as a single generic message so that entire application if there is any error message it will be displayed and whenever there is a success message it will be displayed accordingly for that what we can do so i am going to copy this entire block here here we no need of this validation here and also I am going to remove these alerts from the index view like that I am going to remove it from this is the view which we are going to use it for create and edit purpose so I am going to remove here also so in delete also we will remove it So now we are going to place it in layout.html, go to the shared folder, open the layout. So before rendering the body, we have to call our bootstrap alerts. Here I don't want this and we can remove these things so this is the generic one now we have removed in all our views we have placed inside the layout.cshtml we will run the application again now and we will test whether our bootstrap alerts are working fine or not So we will try to create one employee here. I'm trying to create now. So we are getting the bootstrap alert here. So like this we will try to update this employee again I'm going to make it as click on update so update alert also working fine we will try to delete one record here click on delete employee details deleted so like this in asp.net core we can place our bootstrap alert into the our layout.cshtml so this will be called for our entire project that's it for today if you like this video please like and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching